Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel with the same exact setting again. Um, so you guys, we are continuing on our series of the Profusion Mixed Metal Eyeshadow Kits. And um, last eyeshadow kit was like a huge success. Like I was in total shock with how amazing those shadows had looked. So I'm super excited to go on ahead and dig into the next kit. So the last kit that we had did was the nude kit. I'm gonna go on ahead and I'm gonna link that video down below so you guys can go on ahead and check out that uh, thing. I In the first video I demonstrated, like I showed each palette, not the inside of them, but the front of them. And then I reviewed one kit. Now in this video, it's gonna be strictly for the amber kit. And then in the next video, we're gonna review the smoky kit. So you guys, once again, this is the kit look at how gorgeous these are and once again i did purchase this at target and it retailed for 9.99 okay so let's go on ahead let's open up this bad boy and let's get this show on the freaking road because we got a lot to review so i'm not gonna i'll show you guys the brush but in this kit i'm not going to review the um the uh, eyeliner and all of that stuff because I'm actually what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put the eyeliners like in another like I'm gonna put the eyeliners in like my kit or I'm gonna give them to my sisters or my mom and I really don't want to be swatching all of the eyeliners and eyeshadow brushes and everything so I'm gonna I'm gonna link down the first video and in the first video you guys you guys will get to see how the eyeshadow primer that comes in the kit swatches you guys will get to get a better look at the eyeshadow blending brush and then you guys will get a better look at the um eyeliner that's in the kit so i went on ahead and i swatched everything in there but i'm actually not even gonna touch these ones i'm just gonna put them back in the packaging because i'm gonna put make cute little like makeup bags for my sisters and for my mother for christmas and so i'm just gonna put these in their little uh, makeup bags i'm gonna of course i'm gonna include other items but point is is you guys all that we came to see is this bad boy right here we have the amber profusion mixed metal eyeshadow palette here's the packaging on this you guys so we have super cute packaging super nice very glittery very um very modern i feel so the packaging is a little bit different i'm going to show you guys the nude one oh where did it go where did it go where did it go where did it go so right here you guys we have the nude palette so i want you guys to kind of see the difference in color so it's not the same palette this is the nude palette and then the amber is more of like a rose gold as you guys can see so here is the amber uh palette so this is super cute and this comes with nine matte and metallic shadows so you open it up you get the huge mirror that the last one had came with and then you get nine huge panned eyeshadow shades so here you guys is the amber palette so i'm sorry if you guys cannot really see it that well we got a couple of shimmers so this is a shimmer this is well metallic we got this metallic this metallic this metallic and this metallic and i'm gonna go on ahead and swatch like this like the first one we're gonna swatch down royal rose like that okay so the first shade you guys that we have to swatch is pixie so i'm gonna go on ahead and i'm gonna swatch pixie and i'm just gonna swatch it right here on my hand just like how we did it last time we're just gonna swatch okay you guys so pixie um we are kind of having a little bit of fallout problems but that's totally okay it's nothing too major but pixie's pretty pigmented it's supposed to be like a shimmer shade these ones are not as metallic as the last one so our last palette i'll go on ahead and give you guys a peek these shades come off more like some of the shades come off more metallic -y than others but these do not come off as metallic -y. they come off more like shimmer shadows so hopefully this goes well next shade you guys in the palette is polite and the as i'm swatching it's a matte shade and as i'm swatching it you guys it feels so creamy and it's so pigmented on my finger so i'm gonna go on ahead and i'm gonna swatch polite for you guys so polite you guys is no different than our mattes and the other one this is kind of coming out really pigmented and it feels so creamy and there's like no fallout on this swatch so i think that that's super awesome next shade you guys in the palette is entitled 
wannabe and I'm gonna go on ahead and I'm gonna swatch wannabe right here so here is wannabe you guys it's a very light subtle pink shade which I think is super super cute and these shades are pretty strong you guys if they're showing up on my skin tone because I'm pretty freaking brown okay next shade you guys in the palette is likable so we're gonna go on ahead and we're gonna swatch likable after this whole series is over I will be doing eye looks on this on these palettes so here you guys we have likable it's a really nice like nude I feel like if this palette should have been the nude palette rather than the amber palette but that's totally okay um the shade is actually pretty these shades are pigmented you guys because they are showing up on my skin and they are pretty consistent you know for this whole kit retailing for $9.99 like these are super consistent and I think that that's super awesome next you guys I'm gonna go on ahead and I'm gonna swatch the shade outgoing and I'm gonna go on ahead and I'm gonna move the swatches over here okay so there you guys is outgoing um I'm so sorry you guys but you guys can still kind of see some of the other shades try to ignore those other shades that did not even wipe off of my arm fully from the last palette. So there you guys is outgoing and that is super, super pigmented. I really like that shade, it's gorgeous. And the formula feels mega creamy on these palettes, like it's ridiculous. Next after outgoing, you guys, I'm gonna go on ahead and swatch the shade Fearless, which is super nice. And I'm just pressing very like lightly, you guys. This is the product left on my hand. Fearless is definitely a pigmented color these are leftover shades from the last palette that are not coming off of my arm I'm gonna have to spray my arm with alcohol after this next shade you guys that I'm gonna swatch is entitled celestial so that's super cool are you guys like do you guys watch uh, Marvel Marvel comic films you guys know who the celestials are check out celestial I'm gonna try and block out that leftover residue from the last swatch but look at how like come on you guys look at how metallic that is like that is literally gorgeous they have very minor fallout like very minor fallout nowhere near the whole anastasia subculture controversy but just very very minor fallout i'm gonna go on ahead and swatch the shade burlesque sorry you guys if the camera was shaking so here's the shade burlesque you guys i'm in total shock with how pigmented this this color scheme kind of reminds me of the laura lee cat pajama palette does it remind you guys of that is that weird kind of not really but super pigmented shades and then the last shade in the palette you guys that i'm going to swatch for you guys is called tricky so this shade is very weird it's like a matte shade but it has like hints of uh, glitter in it. You can't really tell, but it's like a matte shade that kind of has like hints of like a little sparkle to it. So it's not like a shimmer shade. It's like a matte shade, but that has like almost like sprinkle, like they just slightly sprinkled glitter. So there are, these are the swatches, you guys, of the palette. I'm sorry if they're super horrible. I'm so sorry. I'm just trying to get these videos in for you guys, but what do you guys think about this palette how do you guys compare this to the first palette and whatnot i think that these palettes are definitely worth their buck um i think that they're gorgeous palettes um definitely if you're a makeup collector these are gonna look so pretty in your makeup collection and i just i'm not mad to have picked these up love you guys god bless you and give me your thoughts on this palette please okay see you guys soon in the next review